if this finals can teach us one thing, is that power is not necessarily in Kendo. But when I mean power, I mean hitting hard. There is power in their body. There is power in their techniques, but it's not focusing on hitting hard. <laughs> It's focusing more on being effective. Remember, we're not trying to clobber down our opponent. We're trying to make a cut with a sword. Of course, we have a blunt sword. We're not going to cut. But our goal to get an Ipong is not to hit the hardest. It's to hit efficiently as if we're having a sharp sword. My opinion. If you watch this Ipong. It's not particularly hard, but it's strong. The body posture, continuity the commitment into a technique, all of this, that's the power, that's the strength, but not hard hit. I guess what I'm trying to say, if you're trying to work on hitting harder, work on having better Kiken Taichi, better Tenouchi, and Sutemi. Don't work on hitting down into the target. If you enjoyed this video, you may also like this breakdown of Murakami's winning men on the final match of the All Japan Kendo Championship. Please let me know down in the comments, what are you struggling with your Kendo at the moment? If you haven't, take a second and subscribe if you would like to keep getting more Kendo tips your way and share this with someone you want their Kendo to improve. Thank you for watching.